name is Darlene and I have Parkinson's. Well, my medicines are not 100% working right now, so I thought I'm going to take the time while I'm just sitting still. So you don't have to see me all animated and moving everywhere. I just take the time to say good morning to everybody. We're going to sort of do a, what, how does my day go today? I have, I don't have anything major planned today. I have a lot of little things that I want to do. And when I have a lot of little things, it's pretty easy because I just do them as I can. I just do one or two things at a time and eventually they all get done. Um, I'm trying something different for dinner tonight too. So that, that'll be kind of interesting. I bought a big bag of like stir fry type vegetables and I'm just going to, oh, speaking of which, I forgot to take the meat out of the freezer. I got to go do that. I got to take some meat out of the freezer. And we'll just add some meat to it and stir fry it up and, and we'll see how it goes. I, it has some kind of sauce in it. I think it's a ginger sauce. I'm not sure. I have to take a look at that. Anyway, that's what's planned for that. I'm going to do the menu plan today. I need to menu plan with easier things because I put too many things on it and then I'm buying groceries and we're not getting to them because we can't possibly eat. There's only two of us. We can't possibly eat all the stuff that I make and then I'm giving it to the kids and I'm doing, I, I just have to, you know, learn to cook less than what I'm doing. The weather is beautiful out there today. It uh, The snow is still there, but it's starting to melt because it's, well, it's minus one right now, but it's going to go above zero. So that'll be nice. So we're doing that. Claudine's supposed to come over a little bit later today. Um, Bill and I are going to be challenging each other to a game of Yahtzee. He trounced me twice last night. I don't know. I have to figure out what I'm doing wrong. I, I couldn't roll the dice for anything. I couldn't get three of anything. But anyway, today is a whole new day and I'm planning on getting a better score today. Let me take a look at my list and see if I have anything else. Um, oh, I was gonna, you know what I was going to tell you? I was going to tell you that um, when we were living in Prince George, we had a house that well, there's a whole story behind the house. But anyway, we have a house that was falling down around us. It wasn't supposed to be falling down around us. It was a disaster. And we ended up having to destroy the house and take it down and build another house. So anyway, um, we bought a kit house where everything was built in a factory. And then it was shipped to our house in pieces. And then it was assembled. It was like a proper build. It's not a mobile home. It's a proper build. But it was assembled again on our property well anyway we were out doing a lot of the work ourselves and and this fellow who was the overseer the contractor guy for us he saw that Claudine was a really good worker she was probably I'd say 14 at the time and he saw that she was working really hard and he says to her he says your parents pay you for that she goes well a little bit and he says well if you'll work that hard for me he says I'll pay you a bit more so anyway she got to work with him which ultimately made me have to pay more for her working because we were paying her cheaper, but we were paying him and he was paying her. So we ended up paying more for her her labor, but she had a good job out of it. But he said to her, you will, on the job site, you're not a girl. On the job site, you are a boy that's working hard. That means you bring a lunch. You bring plenty of water to drink because it's hot out here. And if you don't, you'll be sent home. She took a big lunch. She said she would, and she lost weight left, right, and center because she was working so hard. But you know, she would, we would have asked her 50 times to go and shovel some gravel and never get it done. He would say to her, okay, for the next hour, you're shoveling gravel. Okay. And off she'd go shovel gravel. <laughs> but anyway, that was one of her jobs that she had. And she got a lot of good experience with that. So that was nice. So anyway, at the very end of this video, I do have a picture of Bill and I when we were painting that house that we were building. And uh, so I'm going to insert that picture from many years ago of Bill and I when we were much younger and we were painting. So I'll put that picture in at the end. Um, let's see, what else do I have to do? Um, oh, I want to organize my drawers. I've got to, I've got to switch things around it. My drawers are a bit jumbled. So I'm going to organize my dresser drawers and I have to go into the refrigerator and kind of organize the fridge so that I've got my vegetables in sight so I know what I have. I've got some apples in there that I'd forgotten I had. So I need to sort of shift things around so I can see what I have. And then I will be able to enjoy them at the time. So that's my good morning to everybody. I hope you're having a good day. And I will check back in with you when I'm doing something a little more exciting. Hopefully I'm moving a bit better here pretty soon. 
And I'm going to go challenge Bill and maybe I'll be able to update with a win in Yahtzee. Okay, talk to you later. Good morning. Well, sort of midday. I, it's noon. So <laughs> halfway through the day. Um, I wanted to pop on here. I'm sitting just very still right now. So I'm waiting for meds to affect me. So I figured while I was doing it, I'd just give you an update. I beat Bill at Yahtzee. That's rare for me. I have this to say, very rare for Three me. The dopine, one and it, it's uh, one of those things. He's, he doesn't play very conventionally and he always wins. <laughs> so It's crazy. But anyway, today I did win, which is nice. Um, I'm also starting to get some prep done for dinner, but I had to stop because my meat wasn't quite thawed. And uh, so I'm going to put it in the pan to finish thawing it, but I couldn't get the paper completely off the bottom of it. So I'm giving it a few minutes. I don't like thawing meat in the microwave, so I'm just going to give it a few minutes and it should be ready. And I'll pull the paper off and then we'll put it in. I'm doing kind of a stir fry. It's going to be chicken stir fry, but I've decided I've got ground pork. So I think I'm going to do ground pork with that. And I just looked at myself in this monitor and I am looking extremely haggard. I don't know my hair. I don't know what to do. I have to get it cut and uh, it's driving me insane. It's crazy. So let me take a look at my note. See what else have I done? I haven't done very much really, but uh, oh, I did. I did do something. I went in and I went through my drawers because I had clothes in there that were just not going to be used anymore. So I did go through and get rid of some of my clothes. Um, Got a couple things I need Claudine to help me with when she comes over. Oh, my next thing is I'm going to organize my fridge. It doesn't need to be cleaned. It just needs to be organized. I've got a few things in there that, uh, you know, need to be pulled closer to the front so I remember that I have them and, and whatnot. And uh, so I'm going to organize that fridge up a little bit as soon as I'm moving. Claudine told me about two good movies um, on Netflix. And so sometime in the next four or five days, I want to get a couple of those movies watched. One was called The Peanut Butter Falcon, and one was called, uh, I think she said, Blue Miracle. And she said the Blue Miracle was a true story, and the other one she didn't think was a true story, but it was very good. She said they're feel-good movies. I like feel-good movies. All right, well, I will come back on. I'm, I'll wait, and when I got closer to the dinner time, too, I can show you what I'm cooking there. It's a big, big bag of, like, vegetables that are fresh that are all chopped up and has some kind of a sauce with it and I'm going to put pork in it and we'll see how it goes. Bill likes his vegetables very soft so what I, I might do with them sort of al dente and then take his and put them into the microwave for a little bit longer to cook them a bit. We'll see. I'm not sure how I'm going to do that yet. I have to look at it. All right well that was just a little quick update of what we've done and a little bragging on my behalf because you know I don't win very often so when I do I like to say I won. <laughs> All right. Come back later. Okay, we're back. I'm just going to show you what I'm doing for dinner. In this fry pan, I have some lean ground pork, which I am uh, frying up. And then over here, I have a bag that says ginger garlic uh, fresh vegetable kit supposed to be some sauce in here. I don't know how much of this we will use, but oh, there's the sauce right there. It probably has cooked down quite far, but I would think that that's a lot for us. So I will just put this back in the fridge. You all okay? Okay, you fell. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. I will get the other stand here and I'll be right back. Okay, let's try this again. I'm tired today and I'm making all kinds of mistakes. So, just gonna make the dinner and I think I'm gonna have to call it stop for today. So, let's see. Sometimes you just have days like that. All right. So let's just sort of toss this for five minutes. 
I'm going to put the sauce on it. I hope it's good sauce. I've never had these before. All right, let's see. Oh, I'm even dizzy. I just... I did too much this morning, I think. And then that does me in. Okay. Accomplished the laundry this morning and cleaning the drawers and cleaning the fridge. Did a bunch of paperwork. Oh, this smells really good. I think I'm going to put a few little toasted sesame seeds in too. Sesame seeds. Now I think Bill will probably want his cooked a lot more than mine. So I'm going to just turn it off here and then I'll take his out and cook his separately. But anyway, I thought I would just show you what we were doing for our dinner. And I'll say thank you so much for joining me today. This was a, how was my day today? And my day was tiring. But that's all right. It's good to be tired. All right. Talk to you all tomorrow.